on the strength of this possibility god will never give you an excuse he will never accept the excuse that i was tired because the spirit of god has a capacity of what quickening your mortal bodies i want you to say this words with me give life to my spirit give life to my mind and quicken my mortal body now you didn't say it like somebody that believes say give life to my spirit give life to my mind and quicken my mortal body oh that's what i say when i'm down and an invitation comes for me to preach the gospel i step back and i say give life to my spirit i say give life to my mind and quicken so that time when you come back from the lecture room you have been doing reading for about six hours it's as if you are fully exhausted but your clock just ticked that your prayer time has come if you know how to take advantage of this power a time will come in the process where the weakness will be swallowed up and that the weariness will be subdued and suddenly by spirit power you are going to experience a quickening oh many times like that when i didn't have the opportunity to pray four hours which is my normal tradition before i come to the pulpit and the invitation just comes and and i know that i need to go mm, I, I, do, I, I do the shortcut program i say give life to my spirit give life to my mind and quick every time i did that i preached better than the four hours time of because it's not by power <laughs> it's not by might there is a law that makes it happen something that was ordained by god stronger than every limitation of the natural every infirmity of the physical it, it comes and swallows it up it drowns it and it activates an operation that is only acquainted with the spirit of god why should your life be perpetually figured in the earth there is a dimension that god is calling you to operate from and if you know that plane and you stand on that pedestal you will say things that only heaven has declared jesus said that he that cometh from heaven from above is above all and he speaketh the words of god and the spirit is not given to him with measure oh my god it's only when you operate from that pedestal that you can give voice to the whispers of eternity you can and give language to the utterances of the spirit the bible says that it's the spirit that quickens the flesh it profits nothing on your journey towards attaining spiritual mastery i need to leave you with this food for thought tonight the man that will eventually become a spiritual man is a man that has understood that this scripture is true it is the spirit that quickeneth the flesh profits nothing.